Right, hello everybody, and now I'm going to show you um, a real nappy that's called a fitted nappy. And it's called fitted because, lo and behold, look, it's the shape of a baby's bottom. Nice and soft and fluffy. It's got elasticated side bits so that they grip to baby's legs, but very softly. It's got a long tongue, so you can either use that as extra absorbency throughout the nappy, or if you've got one of those little boys, you can fold that bit to the front and use it as extra soap at the front. You can use a liner so that you are saving your washing, but I would cut it to shape. Because that one's too big for this baby. Very easy to use, much more expensive, usually seven or eight pound these nappies. But very sellable at the end of the day. And that's all there is to it. It will, however, need an outer wrap, one of these fancy wraps that we talked about on earlier nappies, to go around the outside and keep the moisture in. This one's got lots of Velcro on it. You can see there's hooky bits there and smooth bits there. This is so that when you put it in the wash, it doesn't stick to everything else. Put the hooky bits onto the soft bit and that will stop it picking up on um, any other washing you might have in with the nappies. Northumberland County Council do have an incentive scheme for real nappies. If you get a hold of one of these leaflets, you can either download it or you can ask for one to be sent out to you. And on the leaflet, you've got a choice. You can either enter into a nappy laundry scheme and get £30 back towards the costs. You can have £30 cash back if you want to buy your own nappies from, from any source and claim £30 back and that's per baby or if you prefer we have some packs that we can give out free as an alternative to those offers so you can have those with absolutely no commitment that was 12 nappies, 3 wraps and the roll of liners all we would ask you to do is wait until you've had your baby and send off your application form with a photocopy of baby's birth certificate. You must be a Northumberland resident to make that claim.